Hey, this is Ask Geek. Um, I'm actually going to try to explain my Dungeons and Dragons um, realm. And this should be a little shaky. It's the first time doing it. going to, you know, be fancy and try to do this the right way because this is all I have on me right now. Um, to start off, I'm going to go back to 2008. The summer of 2008, I was working where I'm working now, a different house. And I have this program director, which, you know, is my supervisor teach me about Dungeons and Dragons. I made a character named Tomlin Thunder Shield. Um, he was a fighter, dwarf fighter, that was my very first character, so you know how amazing first characters are. They don't last very long. I got him to like level two. I ended up trying to jump on a canoe with a monk that was way too high level for me. He pushed me off and I drowned because of my, my heavy armor. So I decided to try to make a realm out of this guy. You know, as my first character, he has a special place in my heart. He was actually pretty fun to play and which got me started at D&D. So I decided to make a guy named Bruce. Um, oh, I'm going to be Thunder Shields unless I, I tell you different. Bruce is Tomlin's brother. Um, Bruce became a king of the realm that I made, and he lived in a place called Mithrila, who was a dwarven holy city, and he decided to become corrupt, and was kicked out. So, you know, that's the fun part of amazing stories like that. You decide to get a corrupt person and go and make your own city. So he travels to find a spot that making its own city with his uh, now then girl, fiance who had so much love for him that followed him. Her name was Kalista. And Kalista and Bruce decides to go and find a they found this mountain that they rumored to have a mine in and as they were building up their cities and building a nice little house in a town called Shawi. Well, my my names are amazing, but they, shall we? And they decided to mine some stuff. And as they were mining and building up this town, they found this crystal, an unknown, unknown crystal. Um, doesn't really have a name. I haven't really named it, but it's an unknown, unknown crystal. It had secret powers. They decided that um, they needed to use it for, you know, evil. As <laughs> he became corrupt, actually, and pleased to end up not try to be so corrupt, but end up just following Bruce because he loved her, or she loved him. And Bruce um, and Kalista end up having six sons and three daughters, who I'll get to the daughters and sons when we get to that particular point. Um, the only name son I need to bring up right now is his name is Andy, who is a big story of, a big part of my story later. So... Um, Bruce and Kalista start having kids. Undy is the second oldest son and the fourth oldest child. They have the triplets who are the daughters at first, and they have a son named Tomlin after um, Bruce's brother, Tomlin. And then Undy was his second son. Um, after they found this crystal, Bruce got a little bit too corrupt and decided to try to use it to, to go to take over Mithrila. He, he went through this mine and found a portal that he opened up to go to Mithrila. As he did that, the stone got broken up and separated. But later on, Uma, who came through the portal as it opened up, who is Bruce's brother, another brother of Bruce, um, and brother of Tomlin, and Tomlin, my first character, um, comes through and finds Andy, who, you know, is kind of the new prince and king of Shawi after Bruce disappeared. And Kalista went with him too, so they, I don't know where they went. Um, so Andy um, tries, and doesn't want to, but he becomes a new king, and that's pretty much where it opened up. Um, and I started bringing characters in. Uh, playable characters for my friends to play with me, but let's get back to um, okay, oh, That's the way to blow my paper because I'm outside and um, 
my awesome hand, my long thumbnail. Um, and let's just kind of stop there. If you guys like these videos, I'll continue doing this and talk to you more about the storyline with Andy and Uma. So if you guys like it, let me know. I'll do more. Thanks.